As Dallas prepares for the NRA national meeting and thousands of people, police brace for protests. And now a presidential visit. Our Yona Gavino live downtown with our top story. Dan, tonight CBS News has in fact confirmed that President Donald Trump will be speaking at the National Rifle Association's annual meeting a little bit later this week, and the city of Dallas is already preparing. This evening, we saw NRA signs supporting the Second Amendment in place outside the K. Bailey Hutchison Convention Center in Dallas. Last year, the convention was in Atlanta. This year, as many as 80,000 people are expected to attend events in downtown Dallas, along with hundreds of exhibitors. North Texas resident Grant Stinchfield has a show on NRA TV, but doesn't speak for the organization. This will be the safest place in Dallas, I promise you. This may be the safest place in the country. And we urge anyone to come down and talk to us because it is. It's a celebration about the Constitution, about freedom, uh, and certainly about our right to bear arms. The NRA has been under pressure after recent shootings, including the violence at the Parkland, Florida school that left 17 dead. That shooting reignited the debate over gun laws. President Trump proposed plans including firearms training for some teachers and urging Congress to pass a bill to make the federal background check system more effective. Both of the policies are supported by the NRA. Dallas is also bracing for protests, which also happened in Atlanta last year. At least three rallies against gun violence are scheduled during the convention. On its Facebook page, Dallas United Against Gun Violence wrote about its rally, Our goal will be to show the NRA and our elected officials that we demand common sense reform and through our unity show that we will not back down and we will not be bought or silenced. And according to the Dallas City Council memo, uh, the Dallas Police Department is already prepared for crowd control. A lot of demonstrations, Dan, are planned at various locations around the city with one large protest planned at City Hall on Saturday. Be a busy end of the week. As, as we hear a little bit more about the president's plans, Yona, what are we doing to learn about his appearance here in North Texas? Dan, I can tell you that our political reporter, Jack Fink, as well as CBS News tonight, they have been hard at work trying to get more information on the details. We do know that in the next few days, the Secret Service should be in town ahead of uh, President Trump's visit. And uh, often, Dan, when a president travels uh, on such short notice, the details, the specific details about his schedule, those will be a little bit vague coming from the White House. Live in Dallas, Yona Govino, CBS 11 News.